Okay, we're gonna go over how to put together a fire training prop, and this is a flashover box. Um, it's a good demonstration for new firefighters. It shows them incipient stage fire, uh, rollover and flashover in a very controlled environment that's cheap to put together. Uh, what we have here is a single four by eight sheet piece of particle board. Um, you can get it at your local lumber yard, about 20 bucks. Um, we've got it marked out into the pieces we need to cut. Uh, Bottom and back, 24 inches a piece. Tops, 14 inches. The front and sides are 12, with the sides obviously cut in half in the middle. And then we've got some pieces left over for making the small chimney inside. This will be okay. Somebody else probably gave it to him because it wasn't working and they didn't tell him. Well, uh, they said, he goes, I, I've gotten five in the last few weeks that haven't worked. Just a second. Sure. Yeah, these, uh... No guarantees Doug isn't going to film you. Covered. my glove and then he went out to start the pump get back in the truck yeah because I told Tim I go hey man, I had a I had a great briefing the next morning for the division wearing your PPE and time when we put the box together this is gonna be our burn chamber that'll go in the corner you got to leave a couple inch gap so that we get some good airflow through to make sure the fire builds fast for not having PPE on? Or? I don't think so. It's like a lessons learned, you know, just... Right. Tim said, um, he goes, I could easily. Fire has just been started in the, the mock container. Still building. Yeah, wow. it's it's starting to roll over up there. If you guys want to get up there and kind of get a look at it, see the flames oh, yeah. starting to roll across the top, out this way. top piece. See how the thermal layer comes down? We'll show it on a top of left cigarette and there ain't gonna make any difference, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> oh! It's not like that. We can't leave one of those open upstairs, did we? This is, this is oh. going a little fast. It's uh, yeah. it's not actually gonna flash quite right because it's uh, we got the first part hot so fast. I like the whole box up. Oh, usually there, 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 there we go. There go. See? Yeah. See how it whooshed down? Push down There's a little flash there. See how our smoke's starting to light a little bit here? A little less down. smoke. Now it's going to roll the whole length. And there it goes. Oh, the there it goes. Yeah. Did you all get to see it starting to roll across the top, though? It didn't last very long. We got her got her burning a little too fast. If you want to, if you want to bring the garden hose in here from this side, spray a couple little short bursts in here just to cool the atmosphere up. And then I think we can just hit it up there quick, and then hit it again. Okay, now it's darkened down. Now shut it off, and then it should build up again. But that, 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 that incipient fire is still going. It's gonna build up that smoke down that it'll actually follow the smoke out to the side. Mm -hmm. and... Oh, wow. Yep. There it went. You see how our yeah, smoke's it's... burning? And yep. now it's flaming over again. Yep. 
but two short little bursts of, of water up into the top is going to slow that rollover and hopefully that flash over down from you. Hot as degrees. So if you wanted to, you could hit the dang thing. Let's let's yeah. knock it back down again. Hit it again. Hit it again. Swig it back and forth just a little bit. Okay, we knocked it down. Now let it sit again as long as we got flames and stuff back in there. We slowed the progression of fire down, stopped that rollover and potential flash. But if you hit it too hard, you're going to knock that thermal balance down and you're going to steam yourself if you're in the same room of that fire. I'm out of the lobster. <laughs> it's red. It's red. It's red. But as that builds up heat again, it's still going to do that thermal layer. The smoke's building up. And as soon as it gets hot, it starts rolling over that smoke coming right out at you. And then if you see that thermal layer clear in the back, you can actually see the line of where that front is holding it. See, it's burning clear down to the floor now. If you want to, with everything in active flame, we don't have hardly any smoke at all. That upper part's in full flash over. You can hit it again, knock it back down, and then we can watch it again and again. You see, once you hit it, you get a good cloud of white smoke. You got good steam conversion and stuff. You knocked the flash over and roll over down. Is there active flame in it yet, or is it down? That's what engine four does. We put fire out. But it was hot enough, you put, put enough water in there, you created a whole bunch of steam, and that steam will actually go through the house and put a lot of fire out. Because you're removing a lot of heat from it. Don't kill it this time, Will. Careful. careful. Once it heats that wood up, gets that moisture back out of the wood, then it'll start doing the whole thing. This one is actually going a lot slower, but you can see how fast, once that little flame started back up, on how fast this fire is actually coming back on you. Get some rollover on it. Yep. Yep. I can't see. Oh, it's it's, uh, There's the rollover. Hits that flame and it keeps coming back. Let's grab that extinguisher this time. Oh, there it is. I see it. So we can sign you off. See how well you do. Till it heats all the com components up into that upper chamber and stuff, and then all of a sudden she'll just erupt, and then it just be nothing but flames coming out of it, showing full flash over. There we go. 